Hey everybody and welcome to day number six of our clean eating challenge. I am Stephanie and today we are going to talk about intuitive eating and feeling like you are still hungry and you want to eat and what we can do about this. So are you feeling hungry between your five and six meals that you were eating during the day? If you are, then good job. This means that your metabolism has kicked into gear, your body, body is learning what it is supposed to be doing, your metabolism is up, and um, you should actually be feeling this way to a certain degree in between your meals. So let's explain what intuitive eating is. It is about becoming more in tune, attuned to your body's natural hunger signal rather than tracking your calories and what you were eating all of the time. It's just learning to becoming in tune with your body. So it's intended um, with intuitive eating, it's intended for you to create a healthy relationship with food and your mind and your body. So what are things that we can do um, to fight off those hunger pangs? And these are things that I wanna make sure that you're doing to really be able to distinguish between um, true hunger or more like boredom um, or you're just not feeding your body what it needs and so you're hungry. So first I want you to make sure that you're drinking adequate amounts of water. So make sure you're getting in the amount of water that you need to be drinking in the day. Second, I want you to increase your green veggies or high fiber veggies with your meals. Um, these are things like cauliflower and celery and spinach and broccoli, they are high in fiber and low in calories, so they fill you up and keep you full for longer. Um, and they will help fight off hunger. Third, I want you to make sure that you're eating proteins and good fats with your meals. Um, and then four, if you really are truly hungry, so you are having those hunger pings, you have made sure that you're drinking your water, you have eaten your high fiber veggies, um, you have eaten proteins and good fats with your meals and you are feeling hungry still, sometimes you are going to feel this way. Um, this is when intuitive eating comes into play. You need to listen to your body. Um, you want to make sure that you are feeding it. If it really is hungry, you don't want to be starving yourself. And so do all of those things above. If you still are truly hungry, then I want you to make sure that you eat something eat another good snack. You know, make sure that you're pairing it correctly. Um, you're not reaching for things that are not good for you. You can also say at eight o'clock at night, you have had your six meals already and you still truly are hungry. You know what? Have another snack. Um, just make sure that you're pairing it appropriately like we have talked about earlier. You know, a good carb and a protein together or um, if you want to help with weight loss, then you want to stick to just the proteins in the later evening hours. Um, we want to make this clean eating lifestyle a uh, lifestyle change. You know, we don't want to just be doing this short term, but we want you to be able to be successful with this so that you're eating like this on a daily basis. Um, so you need to learn to listen to your body um, and truly get to know what your hunger pangs and cues are so that you don't have to go hungry. Anyways, everybody have a good day. Thanks. Bye.